Back tonight to Eyewitness News here at 6. You know, they look adorable, maybe on TV from a distance, or if you see them on Facebook or TikTok. But bears are, of course, very dangerous. Yeah, and they're getting into our trash bins and homes more than ever with several incidents in the last two weeks. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Dylan Fearon shows us why our state is torn on what exactly to do about it. You can see their paw prints. Lexi Zilla's showing us how a family of bears have been binging on her trash, punching through garage windows, stealing a garbage bag full of salmon and deli meat. And how about this, bringing down the bin, even with straps and metal plates to make it difficult. It does seem a little crazy that they're getting a little bit more bold, though. It keeps happening to Lexi and many others across Connecticut. Bears heading east to feast, coming into our yards, our homes, even opening freezer doors. It's shocking, bizarre, and dangerous. Don't leave your doors open. I mean, they're bears. They're hungry, so I get it. It's, it's scary. They're getting more aggressive. Jenny Dixon says the black bear population has nearly doubled over the last several years. She's the Wildlife Division Director for Deep, concerned about recent incidents in Simsbury and Burlington. Bears getting into homes. Luckily, no one hurt, but there's fear eventually someone will get hurt or worse. And as they become more food conditioned, as they are much more comfortable walking through our yards, breaking into our houses, that's a huge concern. Jenny says if you see a bear, observe it from a distance. If it's close, shout and wave your arms or slowly walk away. Never attempt to feed or attract bears and report sightings to Deep's Wildlife Division. For years, Deep has recommended a limited bear hunt. State Representative Eleni Cavros DeGraw says the state is split on that. It hasn't gotten far in the legislature. There are a lot of people who disagree with the hunt, as many that agree with the hunt. And the reality is we need people to not put their garbage cans out until the morning of. We need people to eliminate as many food sources, clean off their grills, take down their bird feeders, because that's how we're really going to keep people safe. There are several states in the Northeast that allow some sort of bear hunt. New Jersey, New York, Pennsylvania, Massachusetts, Maine, Vermont, and New Hampshire. If a bear somehow ends up in your house, call your local police. In Burlington, Dylan Fear and Channel 3, Eyewitness News.